all was going well to one fateful day. You know, back in the day, it just wasn't acceptable to see a big black burly man and a skinny white woman in the 1930s and 40s. And so after the anniversary dinner, a man came up and saw him together and he lost his temper, did a bad thing. He took his fist, went back to Cuba, came up through Alabama and hit the man in the jaw and broke his neck and went to jail. And when that happened, disaster hit the family. Grandma got cancer. She couldn't, they took out her eye and some of her face and they lost their house, they lost their car, all because of a virtual behavior and decision. And my mom was the oldest of the seven kids. At, she was 14. And during that time, a man saw her and said, you know what, you are sitting on a gold mine. And she said, where? He said, you're sitting on it. Let me help you mine this gold. Now, she's 14. Now, this is a part of being without a father, that when there's nobody to protect and guard the family, predators come in. And they basically turned her out. She became a call girl, selling her young body to grown men for money to, to support the family, and she got pregnant. And that's called having a trick baby. You're turning a trick with a customer, you get pregnant, and they wanted to kill that baby because it's in the way of their profitability. And so they tried different things to abort me from her womb, but it didn't work, but she had me and it was tough, James. You know, when you're a young woman with dreams and aspirations and hopes and your life is shattered, your father's in jail, your mother has cancer, and here you are, the oldest woman and sometimes beauty in the wrong situation can be a curse and not a blessing in that particular environment. So she's pregnant, she has the baby. I come out a little bit premature. I have all kinds of problems. I wet the bed, I stutter. I'm just not a good species of human being. And they said, see, you should have aborted him. And I can tell you one thing, even though I was born a trick baby, the trick was on the devil because God had a plan. Yes.